In this video, I'll try to explain practice problem 3 from experience 3. Which of the below is the best guess for the standard deviation of the distribution shown in the histogram below? So I've copied the histogram and posted in paint here. And I wanted to show the intuitive explanation of standard deviation. You can think of standard deviation as the average distance from the mean or the center. So this is a nice symmetric distribution, and it's pretty easy to pick off the center. It's right there at 150. And then you want to think of how far the numbers are from there. So we have them grouped in these classes, and we'll deal with those classes one at a time. Okay, so let's do the first one. Now you're going from the center to the center of that first bar. That's a distance of 5 because the bar is 10 all the way across. Same thing over here. It's 5 over there too. So all the things in those two big bars, those are a distance of about 5 away from the average, right? About 145 and about 155. All right, look at the next set of bars out. Going out to those is 15, because you have to go the full width of one bar and then half of another. So that's a distance of 15 there from 150 to 165. Same thing on the other side, because of the symmetry. It's a distance of 15 there. OK, so the t middle two bars are distance about 5. The next two bars are distance about 15. We're going to do one more. And that goes out to these bars. These go out 25. You go two full bars and then a half. From 150 to 175 is 25. And going back this way, from 125 to 150, it's also 25. All right, and then there's some little stuff in the tails, but we can more, more or less ignore that. And so remember I said it's the average distance, right? So we've got stuff that's 5 away, stuff that's 15 away, and stuff that's 25 away. And so the average is kind of the middle of these be about 15. The 5 and the 25 kind of balance together there. Um, and you could think of adding up all these numbers and then dividing by uh, 6 and then you'll get 15. Or just to add up the three numbers on the right and divide by 3 and you'll get 15. So 15 represents sort of the average distance from the center of these values. And if you go Back, you'll see that's one of the answer choices. And that's the correct one. Or we'll learn more about this curve later and uh, maybe a more formal way of figuring out what that number is.